Okay, so oh, today we're, we got a special treat. We got really lucky. We're actually at a very unique place that we're going to learn about with John here. And he speaks very good English. So we're going to learn about how carpets are made, Turkish carpets, because you definitely want a Turkish carpet. Okay. So John, tell me right, hey. about silk. I see yeah. carpet, worms. Yeah. And... So this is the wool spinner. So we have all these cocoons, as you can see, inside the water. You have the dry ones here. Those dry ones are like serving us as bobbins, the silk bobbins. So we are using the like get one uh, complete length of uh, silk filament from each cocoon. We can obtain up to 800 to 1.5 kilometers long silk thread. So yeah, the process is really delicate. So we can see the couple of images here are representing all the process throughout the um, the newborn butterfly before it just like uh, gets out of the Brexit cocoon and then gets out and then leaves the eggs, which are around 350, 400 eggs, and then has the lifespan up to two to three days. Hmm. After that, from the eggs comes out a larva, oruga. Bombix mori, the name of the silk, yeah, the silk worm. So we have to uh, element and feed them with the mulberry trees leaves. Yeah, the mulberry uh, leaves mulberry. are the one of the most important supplements. And after a couple of weeks, when it's satisfied and, you know, just uh, fat enough, it's going to like scoot that little uh, saliva out of the mouth to create this silk trend. And then starts to construct its own cocoon, you know, it takes a couple of um, days or weeks to just finish this, the entire cocoon. And afterwards, <clears throat> when it finishes, it stucks inside. So you can hear that. It's home. Yeah, it's <laughs> right in there. So what we do, the 70%, 60-70%, we've got to collect all these cocoons out from the fields to bring them down here, or just the other manufacturers we have around Turkey. Mm -hmm. So then they're going to, uh, you know, apply that process of because when it's dry, it's so rigid, so it, it, it breaks the trap. So when we put it in a hot water, boiling water around one, uh, one hour, the max. So what's going to happen? This is going to happen. She's going to make some magic to give us a little visual show to how to find initiations oh. of the silk threads out of the Does cocoons. that show up on the video? Yes. It's amazing. So that That's is amazing. The process how we do this. So it's gotta be around 30, 35 threads and body in order to get the required resistance of the thread in order to make a rug. Because rug, in order to make a rug, you have to have a like certain strand of the silk thread to make those durable, really strong. Sort of future rugs, or any kind of rug out of the silicone dress. So you can see these cocoons are bumping on just... top of each other. Huh. So when it finishes, when we get all the silk out of the, each cocoon, so whatever and that still... stays behind is this little silkworm. So they can use this in the cosmetic industry and stuff. So they can uh, produce, for example, lipsticks, or hmm. there's, you know, just for uh, the humidity, you, you just like some uh, cosmetic creams and stuff. Wow. That is just amazing. I, I yeah. would have never imagined that's how you do this. Sure. And then after the process, so this is the raw one. So it's like, you know, just yeah, for sale is... or something. Wow. It's not that soft, but after the process, so it becomes that soft. It's shiny. definitely softer, yeah. Yeah, and it's pretty. It's durable. Yes. So we're gonna have a look at it here. The lady's making those um, handmade wool, 100% wool, wool on wool, handmade Turkish rug. So it consists of three parts. The one part is called warps. All of them are coming on a vertical sense those threads, those are the wool threads. So she's going to 
calculate, count, we have a diagram here. So in each diagram, you have small squares. Each square represents, like the architects, scales. They use scales. So the little scales are symbolizing or informing them in whereabouts, which color, in which design they have to apply. So they have to count all of them and then, you know, just to finish the rows. And each this, time this they takes years the rows, to learn. Yeah, it takes yeah. years. They have 20, 30 years of experience. So when they make the knot, so when they finish the each line around, depends on the like wool thread for silk or wool and cotton. So the uh, the quantity of the knots per centimeter square depends on the thread and, and the complexity of the design. So in order to in order to this explanation, you know, um, so as to understand the price or the value of a rock, so you have to look at it. Material is important, but the labor work is the most important. Yeah. So she's going to show you how to make a famous Turkish knot, a double knot technique. So there are two threads, one in the front, the other one in the back boat, in the behind, the back, sorry. So she's going to just uh, strap it around and then make a Turkish knot, a double knot, and then she push it, pulls it down and then cuts it. And then she got to apply, she got to finish the each row. So each row consists of hundreds of hundreds of knots. So after that, she's going to pass the one, it's called that, the horizontally, after finishing the each one. She's going to sit all those knots tight by using that special tongue, it's called kirkit. After she, she's done with that process, so she has to, right now, in order to regulate, you know, in order to get it, clear a plain surface so she has to get rid of the rest. So what are we do all these rests? So we can do, um, you know, refill the cushions and pillows. Mm -hmm. So there, yeah, I mean, you know, just recyclable uh, ways to not to waste any material. Yeah, and that's so a really important true. thing because I know with yes. a lot of textile there's so exactly. much waste. Exactly, so much waste. So we are trying to like, avoid that to give more purposes. So this is gonna run maybe three, four months of labor work is going to take her. But it what size is this gonna be? Three, three, three meters by, by three, three yeah. by four meters. Three by four yeah. Meters, yeah. Wow. So better than machine any better day. Better than yeah? machine anyway. So of course the durability and then you know just the art. But they're artists like we call them like as our like carpet rug artists. So doing this manually, it's. Uh, something really, really um, compromising. So if you look at this side, we have the silk made rugs, which are smaller, but the silk threads are way thinner than the wool threads. So it takes even longer time to make a rug, a silk made rug, rather than the wool or wool. Yeah, I can barely see exactly. the, the vertical. Imagine they have to sit in front of that and then just one by one, have to just do all these designs, apply all these designs from that. So the next time you're looking at a real Turkish rug, you better appreciate how much <laughs> labor. I mean, we hear how long it takes, but now you can see that there's definitely no lie in how long this takes. It can take up to one year of work, a small size. Just This so is not even a meter, maybe. Mm -hmm. Like this one, for example. You see, it's also silk made rug. Yes. Well, it does say no photos, so I'm taking video. John said it's okay, so YouTube sensors don't kill me on this one, please. Thank you. Look at the, you know, this contrast and the shades and the light contrast of these tails. You see the direction of the sun from where it reflects to that. So. so there's lots of cats in Turkey. You'll appreciate this one. <laughs> That's a photograph. That does not look like silk, but that is silk. He likes, he likes, you know, just flying to the cameras. All right, <laughs> now here's the famous Aladdin, carpet Aladdin. He's gonna make the color change. Ole. Oh, there it is. Look at that. Ole. And now, there you go, the magic rugs.
Does it fly though? Yeah. Well, if this we jump. This is Selenay, <laughs> Selenay, right? Where That's the fish is designed. They used to be used as palace rocks. Mm. Chok Shia, Chok Bidman. Also this one, for example. These are award winner designs. Silk and cotton, silk and cotton. And here we are with a hand tafted rug, which is the kaftan clothing of Sultan, also changes the color. It's silk and cotton. For example, what I think, which one is silk? Which of one these five? Made, you think? I want to say all attention. of them. <laughs> this might be a really ideal. Mm -hmm. This rug. And you can, since you live in Turkey, like in Antalya, so you don't have to worry about the shipping is way cheaper, where you can take it with yourself. It's gonna be, it's gonna give you more flexibility on the, the the value of the rug, the price. And you ship all over the world, yes? Sure. Yeah. <laughs> Or another runner like this, for example, since you're like to impress mm -hmm. this, it's beautiful. You can decorate any part of your house with these beautiful artifacts. Like this, for example. The one on the wall is it from a different color. It's for cobalt. cobalt. Yeah. That's a unique color. So you have this beautiful greenish blue color. This is precious. Then it's a different color. Or if not, you know, it's the question. It's wool. But I think like bamboo makes plant ones. Plant ones might be more recommended for you since you live in that warm place. So there is an anti humidity option for the, the bamboo made drugs. Mm -hmm. Okay, so John, thank you so much thank for the show. Much. And gentlemen, for thank coming. you so much. I appreciate it. See yes. you always welcome. Yes, so if you're in Turkey, well, you better be here. Or at least, well, let's see if we can find these guys online, maybe. Yeah, and then they could ship to you anywhere in the world. Or you so. can recommend us to them after you get your rug. Oh, I will, I will have their information in the description <laughs> below this video, believe me. So thanks for watching, and thanks for the show. Thank you. So much, John. Thank, thank, you. You. thank you. Thank you. Take care. It. Okay. Take care.